Are you known for doing things differently? Embracing new technology and seeking out ways to be more efficient? If the answer is yes, why should your wedding be anything different? Stick around and I'll share some invitation designs that are truly unique, incorporating links, QR codes, and other tools. Helping keep guests informed and excited about attending your one-of-a-kind wedding. Hi, I'm Stephanie, and I'm a talent partner here at Canva. And I wish I had access to some of these tools when I got married a few years ago. Look, when it comes to designing a wedding invitation, it can be difficult to create something truly unique, especially if you're trying to avoid florals and scrolly fonts. What are you left with? Today, I'm going to show you how to design modern wedding invites that are far removed from a traditional style or format. If you are after the more traditional printed style, Check out my other video where I go into detail about that side of things. And if you don't want to miss other great videos, make sure you subscribe. Now, if you're looking for a savvy and cost-effective way to get your invitations out, then digital could be the perfect way to do it. The rules really change when you go digital, and the best way to explain is to show you something I've made for a destination wedding. Let's start by identifying what sets this invite apart. First up, the color. The lime green paired with black screams that this is going to be no ordinary wedding. It's fun and modern and perfectly symbolizes their desire for an epic party. Next, the boarding pass design. This hints at the fact it's a destination wedding without totally giving it away. On the next page, guests will discover it's to be held in Bali. And finally, the integration of a QR code and hyperlinked button. These are both genius ideas for getting your guests to RSVP right away. In this instance, guests have the option to RSVP by scanning the QR or hitting the button to respond via email. But this technology could be used to link up anything from a gift registry to a photo drop box. You could even collect dietary requirements by adding a Google form. Let me show you how easy it is to add a basic hyperlink or QR code. With the hyperlink, I'll delete this button and remake it from scratch. First, I need to create the button shape. So I'll go to lines and shapes and select this rectangle. I'll click here to curve the corners and adjust the size to make it look more button-like. Now I can just double-click to add text. I'll write RSVP here. To make this clickable, I'll go to the link symbol here. But instead of adding a website, I'm going to add an email address. That way, when guests hit the button, they'll be prompted to compose a reply with the return address already filled in. Now for the QR code. I'll begin again by deleting what's already there so I can show you how I made it. You'll find the QR feature by clicking More, then scrolling down until you see this app. Click here, then you'll be prompted to add a URL. Hit Generate Code and you've got yourself a unique QR that anyone can scan with a smartphone. This is when you can add a link to a Google form to gather attendance numbers and dietary requirements, or anything else you may want to share with your guests. You would have noticed in the preview, specific things were animated. This is where digital excels over printed, and it's also super easy. Let's say we want the plane to fly in. Select it, click Animate here. I think Pan would work well. We just want it to enter, then stay put while the invitation is read. If I hit Preview again, you'll see that the plane now moves in. You could also choose to have the whole page animate. Make sure nothing is selected and then hit Animate again. Now you'll see page animations. By choosing this, you will update all the animations on the page. When it comes to sharing this invitation digitally, I'd suggest creating a view-only link and sending it directly to guests via direct message or email. You can do this by clicking on Share, then selecting View Only Link. Just keep in mind that if you change the design, you'll also need to resend the link. I've been talking all about how digital allows you to break free from the rules of print. But it's just occurred to me that I've not told you about the biggest advantage of digital. When you're a digital, you don't need to have pages. In fact, you could easily make a little video. Let's have a look now. Let's begin by choosing a blank video template. I'll choose a square one. Now I can announce the engagement and invite people to the wedding, 
all in the one video clip. The best thing about video in Canva is that all the effects and tools you've used in the normal editor carry across. From elements to frames, effects and animations, they operate just like they normally do. I can add in a new scene just like this. Add in the date and even put a QR code so people can RSVP really easily. I'll put one last scene here so I can include another QR code for a gift registry. Then drop in a fun little video to end on. Imagine everyone's surprise when they receive this. They're sure to be left with positive vibes. I can just go up here and select the share button and send out a link so everyone can see it on whatever device they are on. It's amazing how quick and fun it is to make videos. One of the most powerful things about Canva is your ability to copy the document and adjust it to fit a slightly different purpose. Say the wedding has happened, and I want to send another video that thanks everyone for coming and shows a few choice shots from the day. Because it's a copy, I've already got the fonts, colors, and elements in there. I can just move them around and create something completely different. And in no time at all, I've got another video ready to send out. Maybe I'll add music to this one as well. Designs like this get me excited and make me want to digitize everything. It's so practical and impressive. I look forward to the day digital invites become the norm, so it not only saves time and money, but a ton of effort, so you can focus on all the other fun that a wedding entails. Let us know in the comments how you went digital. I'd love to see any designs you come up with, maybe even utilizing the video editor. Also, if you found this video helpful, please like and share the wedding love so others can benefit from it too.